G'day and welcome back for more Kerbal Space Program multiplayer. We're back. We're back and we're gonna make some planes. Uh, oh, let's find no. some missions for some planes. I'm gonna accept this Explore Kerbin one because I kind of want it. The science it's... data one has like calculus on it. I don't want to do any calculus. <laughs> Have we got any like uh, things below certain altitudes? That's space around Kerbin. Yeah, oh. there's the observational surveys. They're all above a certain height. Ugh. Which is like 18,000, 19,000 meters. Yeah. Uh, oh, there's, Atmospherics has two below. There's uh, test landing gear at the launch site. We could probably do that. Let's also accept these uh, pressure readings ones. Atmos conduct atmospheric surveys of carbon. Okay. Because there are two that are below 18,000 meters. And maybe one of us will get lucky and we'll design a craft that can go above. <laughs> 18,000 free moments. Uh, so that, that's the goal then. Make a plane that can reach 20,000 meters. I guess so. All right. Are we going to do this as a bit of a competition? Who can make the best plane? Yeah, because we can both fly the planes at the same time and fly near each other and stuff. Oh, dear. We could do a race. Oh, man. It's been a long time since I built a plane. Me too. All right. Where are these? Where are these objectives? I'm just going to start building a plane. Yep, you do that while I figure out where the objectives are. Right, that'll do. I think I'll do a test flight. Uh, oh, do no. I wait till uh -oh. I can watch it? Uh, we've got a problem. What's the problem? The problem you just is... tip over on the runway? No, I haven't, haven't left the hangar yet, but I've got problems on my design checklist. Really? Are you too heavy or something? Uh, too many parts. Uh, oh, I need to fix my staging. Oh yeah, I do have too many parts. 39 of 30. Oops. How do we get more parts? Um, you make a smaller plane? <laughs> oh, this is a pretty basic plane already. Uh, shall I show you my basic plane? I'm going to get out on the runway and then we can line up together because we both should be able to get out there. Yeah? Uh, well, I don't know. I got problems. I'm so fascinated to find out what your sh your plane looks like. All right, I'm going to launch, and I'm going to get out of the way so that you can launch when you're ready. All right, just have some square wings. Hopefully they'll give me enough lift. All right, uh, runway. Yep. Launch. Oh, this is going to be a disaster. I know it. <laughs> Here we go. I can see you. you. What? I don't see you anywhere. You can't? Oh, there you are. Oh, this is quite a neat little plane. Oh, you got a big tail thruster. Yeah. Then are those little thrusters on the wings? Yep. Two fuel. How did you get that many parts? What do you mean? This is 26 parts. You got two fuel tanks on each How many engine? science things have you got inside your little. Oh, I forgot about those. I probably should have gone rid of some of those. Have you got like batteries and stuff in there? Uh, apparently, what? Apparently, I don't have a pilot. Oh, well, you've got to recover your craft then. <laughs> what? Hmm. You think you're gonna get that much science done? Well, we got like three locations. We have to do it. Yeah, I'm. Ex I'm gonna be impressed if I manage to get to one of them. To any of them. My expectations are low. <laughs> Proper low. I'm going to be impressed if both of us fly. Let's <laughs> keep it at that. Got a pilot. Launch. Really hope I'm far back enough. Yep, I am. Okay, interesting. Gamak's gone a very much a bird design. Plants? Yeah, um. <laughs> What? Classic. Classic design. Okay, Kavak, you uh, lead the charge down the runway. All right. Oh, I just had flame out. Oh, I'm up. Nice.
try. Oh dear. I'll throttle back a bit so you can catch up with me. Oh dear, oh dear, I don't know that I'm gonna take off. Oh. 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 Landing gear are up. I have barely enough lift. Uh, I am catching up quickly. I'm about to pass you. See ya! Hey! <laughs> I am, I am super, almost supersonic! I think Man, I might be carrying too much fuel. I slowed down to catch up with you. <laughs> and now you just blasted off into the distance. It's because I don't... I have barely enough lift. If I don't go fast, I don't go up. Uh, where's our target? It's kind of north. Oh, it's a that's long a way long north. Way away. Should we see who can, like, see what altitude we can reach? Oh yeah, that might be a good idea. Well, head for head for our destination. It's about forty-five degrees. Yeah. And and climb, and let's see how far we can, how high we can climb. Yep. I'm just gonna set uh, target. Activate oh. navigation. There we go. Now see it's on if my I can see you anywhere. Oh. I see your contrail over there. Oh, cool. Oh, I need to make you louder because I can barely hear you over the engines. It's really yeah. noisy in here. Yeah, I just turned my engine volume down. I'm at a very shallow ascent. I'm at 6,000 meters. How high are you? Uh, 71. 7,100? 7, yep. What What did you cap out at altitude-wise? Uh, I've just leveled off at 8,200. 8,200? And now that I'm leveling off, I'm picking up some speed. Yeah, I'm now losing altitude from 8,700 was my peak. I have broken the sound barrier. Uh, how fast is that? 440 meters a second I'm oh, going. Geez. I'm at 250 and climbing. I think with that chunky engine you got on the back there, you might be a little bit faster on the old acceleration than I... Yeah, just a bit. Alright, let's see how this climb goes. I don't think we're going to get anywhere near 18,000 meters, by the way. I think we're going to need to add little rockets on these things. Uh. We might need to put a rocket where I put my chunky engine and use the other little engines to fly the rocket to where we need to be. That could be kind of cool. Well, I mean, this has gone remarkably smoothly for me so far. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm impressed that we both got off the ground. I think my center of uh, lift is just a little bit too far back. I think I need to bring it a bit further forward to allow myself to take off at a bit slower speed. I have made it to 9,200 meters. And I think that's about where I cap out. Uh, I'm just under 9,000 meters at the moment, traveling at 275. I don't think that's enough speed for me to get much climb from here. Nope, I kept out at 11,500. That's not bad though. Do you think we should maybe not try and get the whole way there, but instead try and upgrade our planes? Well, we're not going to be able to do much in terms of upgrades with the part limit we've got at the moment. Well, that's that's money. We can buy a bigger runway. Ah, uh, okay. I think we've got a decent amount of money at the moment. We've got 800,000. What do you think? Should we try and land? Uh... Yeah. Alright. I'm turning around. Uh, I'm going to try to land on this island. Really? Yeah. Oh dear. I really want to make one attempt at a proper landing. Even if it mean Kab means that Kamak dies. Hey! Okay, we're coming in. I Are you on the ground? I am coming in. Oh jeez. <laughs> we're attempting a simultaneous landing. Oh, oh, I have landed. Well done. Engine oh, shut I think down. I'm falling short. No, 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 sticky keys. Oh. Bad time for sticky keys. <laughs> oh dear. No, come on, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, I made it. I made it. Are you sure? Yep. 
Yep. Oh. Sticky keys, you were almost my undoing. Right, well, I got some grasslands pressure data. Oh no! Oh no 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 Oh That doesn't sound good. Kabak died. Oh dear. Sticky keys why? Why? It's so unfair. Arg. Well, I've sent out the recovery team. Well, I sent out two recovery teams. To upgrade the space plane hangar will cost us 225,000. That will give us more parts. If we upgrade the runway, we'll upgrade our mass. But we weren't really hitting that. Uh, no. I'm at four and a half tons and the max at the moment is 140. Alright, I upgraded the space plane hangar. Huzzah! You now have more mass to take. Did we get an, enough science for anything useful then? No. Uh, I got seven. I don't know what we needed. No, that's not Probably enough. more than 32. <laughs> what do you... <laughs> Big. This, this thing looks pretty serious. Uh, I need some kind of fuel, though. Yeah, I'm gonna go a pair of thuds, and I'm keeping my Weasley engine in the middle. Alright. I have gone for a much greater lift surface. So hopefully that will allow me to cruise at higher altitude. But I think the new flippity doo is ready to go. Uh, okay. I think I'm... Um good to go for this one. This is going to be a long haul flight though. It is. It is. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? Sure. Where are you? Oh, whoa, there you are. Whoa, don't flame me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we've got similar wingspans this time at least. Uh, should we recover and wait till dawn? Or are we doing a nighttime flight? Yeah, you've got a nighttime flying. Oh dear. Alright. You ready for me to launch this time? Yep. Okay. Throttling up. Brakes off. You do have your rocket engines on the separate control, right? Yep. Oh dear. Oh no, wait, wait, no, no, no! Oh dear! Are you upside down? Yep. I don't know what happened. It just started serpentining across the runway. I started getting a bit of a tank slapper going too. Uh, I don't. Hmm. Alright, I'm up. Hold on, I'll try to. I'll try to fix this problem quickly. I will, uh. Do loops of the KSC while I wait for you. I'm worried about the aerodynamics of your tanks. Your liquid fuel tanks. Your, uh, sorry, your oxidizer tanks. Yeah. I'm keen to try and fly in formation, which we might be able to do this time because I'm a bit more capable of low, low speed flight. Are you on the runway yet? Yep. Oh, yeah. I see a shadow down there. Oh, it's, it's real sketchy. No. No! No! Oh! I saw the explosion! No! No! Oh! I saw the explosion! Hmm. Doesn't like those rockets being <laughs> on the wings. <laughs> oh! No! Why have you done this? That doesn't sound good. Uh, but the. Because I moved the rocket, it put it in a different stage so I started blasting that. No! Why? Oh! Oh dear! Oh dear. Why? Why am I suddenly losing control? Just flying about over here. Getting used to how this thing handles. Watching you explode on the runway multiple times. No! No! Death wobble! No! <laughs> no! Oh! Flame out! 
Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Come on, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up, pull up. Hmm. Whew. Engine flame out during a loop the loop is not good. No, oh, no, I don't want to fly the debris. I want to recover it. No. Oh, flame out. Oh, oh. Still can't take off? No. Oh. No, abort, abort. <laughs> oh dear. You're just having endless troubles down there, aren't you? Maybe I messed up the landing gear somehow. I've got mine set out on my wings and um, I use the rotation tool so that I can square it back up again. Yeah, yeah. Alright, we're slowing down a little bit. I'm gonna wait just a bit longer for a kick in the rocket engines and see if I can reach the altitude we needed to, that we're targeting. Okay, three, two, one, rocket boost. Let's tilt it up sharper. Take it up. Take it up higher. Oh yeah. We're going. Ten kilometers. Uh twelve kilometers. <laughs> I am rapidly running out of oxidizer though. Fourteen. Jet engines flamed out. Rocket engines only. We are at 17 kilometers. Almost out of oxidizer. And 20 kilometers. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? 22 kilometers. Oxidizer out. 24. 34. <laughs> and I think I'm going to cap out somewhere around 38. Oh! You in the air? Uh. Yes and no. Oh dear. I might have left my tail behind. <laughs> I am about to hit 40 kilometers. Oh yeah. Will I hit 41? I think I will. Oh, just shy of 41. All right, now I've got to return home. After that test flight, very successful. I can reach the altitudes we require. Oh, that's bad! <laughs> oh dear, what's going on down there? Okay, it definitely doesn't like to replace my rockets. Mm hmm. Where did you put them? Oh, ow, that hurt. Oh dear. Did you just lose another Kerbal? Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Not that I can talk. I've lost one in my test flights. Well, do you want to watch me come in for a landing and we'll then do another simultaneous launch come sunrise? Uh, or do you sure. want to keep... Actually, you should probably keep testing your plane and make sure it can take off. Alright, let's see. No! Why? Hold it together! Like extra intakes. No, I lost the tail again. Oh! Are, you, are your landing gear too far in front of your tail and your tail striking on takeoff? Well... No. I lost my tail because I had to get up into the air because I was squirreling out. But you shouldn't hit your tail unless it's quite long behind your landing gear. And the rockets just make me flip out. I do wonder if you just got lucky on that first launch. No. It is physics that is wrong. Alright, I'm up. I'm headed for the moon. You're flying again? Yep. Okay, now you gotta land, and then we'll take off in the morning. What? Well, unless I get back and manage to land soon, because otherwise you're gonna run out of fuel waiting for me. I've used up on my rocket fuel. Alright, we're gonna do an altitude test. Alright. Yeah, that's actually a good call. You do your altitude test, I'll try and land, then you try and land. And then tomorrow we do a proper launch and see if we can achieve these missions. Well, mm. I've made it to 18,000 meters. We made it over 18. I'm about to touch down. I'm at 18,500 meters, but I've got no... Touchdown! 
Touchdown, touchdown, touchdown! I landed! <laughs> I have so rarely done that. I actually landed on the runway! Oh, no, no, don't toggle the action. Whoops. I accidentally just toggled my landing gear after I landed. <laughs> I did it! I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it, I did it. My rockets went out and they won't come back. Have you run out of an oxidizer? Yes! Apparently. Why didn't they have enough oxidizer? Because you don't have enough oxidizer in your tanks, because the regular plane fuel tanks don't have oxidizer. But it, it's a rocket tank. But you've got regular fuel in your regular fuel tanks. Oh. Oh. Well, that's obnoxious. <laughs> yes, my plane works! Easy for you to say. Yes. What have you... <laughs> what have you done with those weird extra bits of wing that you stick your landing gear on? It seemed like a good idea at the time. <laughs> I think it might also be why everything was... freaking out. Uh, I think I'm going to overshoot. I might have to come back around. Uh, I don't know. You're going pretty slowly. 70 meters a second. Yeah. Doesn't feel slow. Well, when you touch down and put your handbrakes on. Oh, I think you are going to overshoot. You need to just land on the grass afterwards? No, oh, come back around for another pass. Okay. Uh, no, I'm coming. I'm coming down. No, what? Coming down. <laughs> I just dropped out of the handbrake, sky. Handbrake! 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 What just happened? I have no idea. I think you stalled. Well, nicely I mean, done. I safely landed. I'm almost at the runway. Yeah, that's pretty good. Sun is almost about to rise. Capac, come join me. Ready for the launch. Uh, yeah, I'm just making a few modifications. <laughs> Probably gonna blow up again. We need another 40 science before we can do anything. Yeah. Science wise. Yeah, I just had a look at that. That's a lot of sciences. It we is. Gotta get up to the moon. Yeah, we do. And then we have lots of science. Oh, Capac, you need to. Okay, good. You caught up to me. So you're on the runway right now. Uh, yes. Still dark for me though. Uh, can you move a little bit forward? Uh, so that I can get onto the runway too. Oops. Oh dear, what have you done? Might have had a little accident. <laughs> oh dear, what have you done? I might have deployed my landing gear. Can I join you on the launch on the runway yet? Uh, yeah, probably. All right, if we explode, it's your fault. I mean, I'm probably going to explode anyway. This thing's already feeling all rickety. Are you ready, Capac? Uh, I guess so. Um, if you go to your map, there are going to be some little targets that are near the KSC. Pick one. Do you want Gregbin's right. Triumph? I'll pick the... yeah, pick that mm. one. Milwyn, you pick that one? Alright, yep. I'll go for Milwyn's Glory. So this is a crew report you need to do. Okay. Oh, you've t started taking off. Yeah. You didn't wait for me. Nope. No time. Oh, stupid engine flameouts. Let's just shut these two down. Alright, I'm up. And apparently I'm already on target. Yeah, they're really close, these ones. Uh, so what height do we have to get to? Take a crew report above 18,000. Gotcha. So I tend to pin open the cockpit one so that I can click it when I need to. Come back. Oh, right. Yeah. I'm hoping that with the timing we've got, we should come back as the sun is rising. Easy for you to say. What do you mean? Well, I told you, it's still dark for me. Yeah, it's still dark for me too. But the sun is just on the horizon. Oh. Like, you can see the lightning of the horizon, right? I guess so. Haven't had any death wobbles yet, so that's something. <laughs> that's a good sign. 
Oh, I suppose I should go... I should start my angling up once the target is at like 45 degrees above me or just a bit below 45 degrees above me. Yeah. Because I think that's a reasonable rocket climb sort of angle. This plane seems to have a cruise... Uh, seems to comfortably cruise at about 7,700 7, metres. Hmm. Yeah. I'm at 5,200 at the moment. Going all right. Yeah. We've, we've made... I'm not going to say good, but <laughs> functional spa uh, um, plane planes. At least partially functional. <laughs> yeah. I'm going to try and see if I can manage to get both of these targets on one run. See if I can not use up all my oxidizer. Ah. I have some vague feel, vague memory that I might have messed up and I might not have even had full throttle when I was climbing last time. Ah. Uh, because I was distracted by something. Are you trying to imply something? No. Just that I messed up. Are you talking about me? No, me. Implying I maliciously distracted you. Oh, no. No, I wasn't implying that at all. Alright, time for me to climb. All right, we're at 360 meters a second at 11 kilometers. I'm entering an area, but it's not the area I want, and I'm not at the altitude I want. Uh, your trajectory looks all right, though. Oh, no! I just... Oh, dear. What happened? I got one... I got... I got both crew reports. Oh. But I also accidentally deployed my parachutes. Oh. Yeah, that doesn't sound good. No. Also, my engine's just all flamed out. Uh, that means I have to land. I do not have a backup plan. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Keep both rockets off. I don't need them anymore. Unless Capac can't make his target. Which he still is only less than halfway there. Yeah, I might have to put one of those extra engines on this thing. I think you might. Like, are you at full throttle? Yeah. Oh boy. Is this when I do something cheeky and I go and try and get that one? I mean, you could try. Alright. You're the one that already used your parachutes. Well, yeah, that doesn't... I've still got 158 oxidizer. I mean, you did go for the closer ones. Yeah, I know. Uh, I gave you the choice. You chose that one. That's all right. You go do other missions. I'll just have a nap. Oh. You chose... Oh, jeez. My parachute's just deployed. What? I thought you said you already deployed them. Yeah, apparently they had not been destroyed. I thought they'd been destroyed. Uh, looks like I'm splashing down. Unless oh I cut them. Should I cut them? What do you reckon? Uh, I mean, you could cut them and then go... Yeah, powered landing might be safer. Alright, cutting the chutes. They are really going to be gone now. So what's your cruising speed? I'm at 127 meters a second. It's slowly climbing. <laughs> My cruising speed is 300 meters a second. <laughs> no wonder you're so far behind. <laughs> Look, this is the little plane that can. Not the little plane that brags about how fast he is. Alright, here we go. I'm going for it. And I'm out of oxidizer. I'm at 12,000. Oh, I don't think you're going to make it. I believe you could be correct. 14,500. 15,000. I think I went too aggressive. I wiped off too much of my airspeed. 16,4, 16, 16,6. 16, Seventeen two. I'm entering the region. No, I'm not gonna make it. I'm not gonna make it. 
I've made it to 18, but I don't think I'm going to make it to 18, 9. 18, 2, 18, 3, 3 and 4, I'm done. I'm not. 5, 18, 6, 6, and that's it. 18, 6, 40. Oh. Ah, uh, so close. Alright. Oh, did I see you in the sun for a second then? Maybe. Are you about to make your attempt? Yeah, coming up on it. Did you say you went for it when it was at about 20 degrees? Uh, no. My original one, I went for it when it was about about 35 degrees. Okay. So that I could hit 45 and go over it. Because you want to go over it. Hmm. I don't know if that's you or if it's a speck of dust on my screen. I'm trying to fly toward you. Oh. Oh, I just saw you fly past. Oh, did you? I yep. missed you. I was above you. Oh. Right, yeah, I'm trending downwards a bit. I'm gonna have to... Rockets! No! No, why? Oh dear. That doesn't sound good. Oh, why is it doing this? It didn't do this before! Oh, oh, I see him! I see him, he's a speck on the horizon. He's going down. Yeah, tell me about it. Oh, now he's going up. Right. I pulled it back. Oh, you seem to be going quite high. That's the plan. Your apoapsis is, I think, falling quite short. Well, I ran out of jet fuel. Yep. Uh, rocket fuel, I should say. Entering Gregwin's Triumph. Apoapsis 17,000. Yeah. Oh, I think I'm going to just miss it. Yep, you are as well. We were both so close. Yep. 17 to coming back down. But I'm going to try and fly with you. I'm going to see if I can keep at your speed. Formation fly. Or at least do loops around you. Well, I'm not going to stay at your speed, so... I'm getting a target speed indicator, which is... What's your slowly altitude? Slowly ticking downward. What's your speed at? 237. Uh-huh. I think I'm 12 and a half kilometers behind you. Traveling 110 meters a second faster than you. Uh, yeah, looks like you're catching up on me pretty quick. Yeah. A slightly lower altitude. I should be able to see you pretty soon. Still can't spot you. Oh, you pretty much match my altitude now. Coming up mm -hmm. on me pretty fast. Okay, within three k's. Start matching target velocity. Oh yeah, I can see. You can. Oh yep. yep. I see you on my six o'clock high. Coming out of the sun. Well, if you want to do some kind of aerial rendezvous maneuver, it better be quick because we're coming up on the. Yeah, we might need to come into coming. land, can we? I'm going to set my approach vector as I watch you dive. Dive, dive. I think I see you down there. Are you about to land? About to try. Oh yeah, that's you. That's your shadow on the runway. You down? Almost. Oh, oh, bounced. Gone a bit squirrely. No! Oh! You okay? I didn't need that wing. <laughs> I lost both wing tips, but I landed. Nice! Just wait there, I'm down in a second. Alright, I'm gonna try to get off the runway. Oh. I'm down! Did you recover yourself or did you wait for me? Uh, I'm still here. Where, uh, whereabouts? The oh, you're right down the, the end. Alright, I'll come meet you there. I almost overshot again. 
I can't believe I just managed another landing, proper landing with this plane. Especially as I've come down with almost 50% of my fuel. I'm definitely uh, loaded up for a long haul flight. See me now? Yep. <laughs> yes, you are a bit smaller than you were. Alright, Kabak, success. We haven't completed the whole mission yet, but close. This is true. Uh, shall we leave the attempted flights for the long haul one till next time? Uh, yep. Yeah, All I right. think think I need to do some upgrades. Yeah. And for those of you who are much better at designing planes, rockets, and everything else in KSP than we are, I really appreciate the tips you've given us so far. Capac and I are actually recording weeks in advance, so much as we are learning from the stuff that you're sending us, there's going to be some delay before it gets <laughs> enacted, so you will see us do stupid things for some time. But we are still very grateful for the tips, so please keep them coming. Next time, Capac and I will continue our discovery of how to jump through plane wings and how to fly the planes as well. So there's all that and plenty more to come. And we will see you then. Catch you next time, everybody. Oh, my sexy plane. Oh, no. Wait, wait. No, no, no. Oh, oh dear. <laughs> Are you upside down? Yep. Oh, I saw the explosion. No, why? Oh, oh dear, oh dear. Why? No, no, death wobble. No. <laughs> no. Oh, flame out. No. Oh, flame out. Oh, oh. No, come on, come on. <laughs> oh dear. You're just having endless troubles down there, aren't you?